and welcome to, um, well, uh, Hitman, I guess. Um, I don't really know what to record. I mean, it's like three in the afternoon, so I really don't know. But anyways, uh, yeah. So we are going to be playing the small little mission where we get to assassinate a Italian politician who is corrupt. So yeah, um, let's just uh, see how things are. Copyright Italian music, probably, but I really don't care. That is your target, Marco Alright, according to my calculations, there is supposed to be a priest here. Yep, yep, yep. Just praying. Definitely not listening in. Maybe it's Abiati. What do you mean? He's looking for him too. And I heard rumors that they have history between them. That doesn't sound good. We need to find him. He needs to do his work. God's work. Yes, you are right. According to church staff, Marco Abiati wants to meet with local priest Father Francesco, a highly respected member of the Sapienza community. But Francesco is trying his best to dodge him. In fact, the priest has spoken out harshly against Abiati on several public occasions. I wouldn't mind being a fly on the wall when those two exchange blows. Well, uh, she's about to get some divine judgment. Okay, well, technically I can't unlock that. Please don't see me, please don't see me, please no one see me. Ah, that's the ticket. And I came behind the, this, uh... Ah, you the up. Right, that's right, that's good. Actually, you know what? I'll just take your outfit, because I need it. There you go, I'm church staff. Let's go. It's not as cool as my requiem suit, but I still need it. Holy punch you. You understand me? You understand me? Exactly. Yes. Get out of my face. Ciao, Father. I've been looking for you. I want to confess my sins. What's up, Reverend? You know what I mean. I'll see you in the confession.
you, Father, for seeing me. I've been looking for you. I'm listening. Thank you, Father. I thought you would be more reluctant, but I have sinned. I've committed horrible acts of greed, lust, and more. I'm currently planning on evicting this town and all of the old scum that's been sitting on this gold mine. I did it because of avarice, I'll admit. But this is such a beautiful town. It's far too good for the poor. We can make so much money here. And, well, will you forgive me, Father? Ten Hail Marys, and you're on your way to redemption. Is, is that it? You have relaxed with time, Father Francesco. But you would put up a fight. I believe in forgiveness. Okay. I know you won't, uh, talk. Seal of confession, you know. But I want the church on my side. I'm a good Catholic. So maybe join me on the roof where we can talk a bit more privately about how we can scratch each other's backs. Hopefully see you up there, Father. you came to your senses, Father. The Vatican has always been fond of money, for money is God. That's what Nietzsche never understood. God had simply taken another form. The state understands that, but I must confess, I thought you would put up more of a fight. But <laughs> everything changes, I suppose. I dare Father, say divine I intervention is you. in order. Oh, why so serious? Uh, look at this town. It has so much to offer. Together, with the support of the church, this could all be ours. Uh -oh, That's a big place. Uh, don't be. You and I are the same. Ooh. It's all down to politics. Okay. Cool. <laughs> now, what do you say? Will you make the call? There'll be a nice donation in the church's interest. Maybe I'll even give you Caruso's house. That would be good, hmm? wouldn't it? Uh, uh, yeah, it would be, except for uh, dead. Uh, <laughs> yeah, exactly. Freaking, yep. Mm -hmm. Destroyed. Exactly. Exactly. Mr. Abiyati, are you here? Mr. Abiyadi. I'm kidding. <laughs> alright, alright. Don't worry. Don't worry. Mr. Abiyadi's taking a break. Permanently. Alright. Yeah, 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 yeah. You're fine. You're fine. You're fine. You're fine. Let's go leave this. Yep, Mr. Abiyadi. Okay, okay. I want to try a different method. So let's do that.
Marco Abbiati is throwing a political rally at the beach to gain young voters. Yeah, Bravomo is who I'm trying to dress up as. That's who I'm trying to dress up as. Above the law. Yeah. Okay, I can act I actually like this guy I really don't want to knock him out. But um I will I, I will knock him out, but I won't snap his neck. I normally snap necks, but with this guy <laughs> he's probably just gonna have to wake up on a crate the next day. Hashtag I've never heard an NPC say something like that. It's gonna be like free guy or something. Turns out to be a real person. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Even check the bathrooms. <laughs> Command, we got a casualty. Proceeding with caution. Nothing to report from my current location. Over. I'm just gonna take the other direction. Pretend like I was never here. I am definitely the lawyer. Don't worry about it. I'm 100% the same person. Ciao, Bob Walmart. We've been looking for you. See, si. the boss wants 
talk to you. So why don't we go inside? We'll be here shortly. So let's step inside. Aviati will be expecting you in your office. I hope you're not armed. Did she say my office? I I should be able to go to my own office. This is literally my office. I don't know why he's meeting me in my office. Like, shouldn't this be the opposite way around? Isn't that how things work? Yeah, I got caught by the camera. Whatever. Yeah, I was caught doing nothing. I'll destroy these cameras once I kill this guy. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. There you go. Yeah, I committed a crime. Don't know what, but I did it. I'm kidding. I got a pretty nice office. Rabiati can see. Frisk zone, sir. If you want to come through, I need to have a look in your pockets. What do you say? You should just take a minute. No need to worry. We're the good guys, right? And you're good to go. Thanks a lot. Nice to finally meet you, Bravo. I've been hearing a lot about you. Good things, I hope. Well, <laughs> everything is relative, right? Now, I hear that you love our fair town as much as I do. And that makes me happy. We elite need to stick together, build a better world, wouldn't you say? People talk too much. So, are we gonna do this? Whoa, whoa, slow down, amigo. I'm just here to talk. I apologize for the men outside, but I'm very high profile and need protection. We don't need to be enemies. We can become friends. Keep talking. You clearly are a man who knows how to cut through the crap. Don't let anyone in, you hear? That's a Roger, sir. Bravo, Omo. Let me speak frankly. That's what I do, and that is why the people love me. You have something that can, well, can put me in an awkward situation. An unnecessarily awkward situation. For you see, I'm only interested in what is best for this town. And that is money. Now, you can join me, or be against me. What would it be, Bravo? It's a life-altering question. <laughs> Geek. That was a lot more satisfying than the uh, first thing I did, but I will admit this is a lot 
A lot more satisfying, but the last thing we did was a lot more brutal. A lot slower of a death for him. For him, he got instantly poked into the brain. It probably cut through his left brain pretty hard and it just stopped all operation in his body pretty quickly. But when he got stabbed in the stomach, he was pretty much defenseless. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I will see you in the next one.